How's it going, friends? Welcome to this uh, comparison here. Uh, we're going to be doing a charging time test. Uh, comparing here the uh, charging time between the uh, Motorola Droid Turbo and the Samsung Galaxy Note 5. Uh, this is just for reference, guys. Uh, my uh, estimate or my guess is that the uh, Note 5 is going to finish uh, before. Uh, because the battery is smaller but hey you never know so we're gonna find out uh, both phones are completely dead uh, we drain the batteries they're completely dead so they're gonna start from zero uh, we're gonna be timing uh, using a different cell phone uh, take the time and uh, give you guys uh, updates through the process as a quick recap here the droid turbo if i remember correctly on the from the top of my head i think the battery is a 3900 milliamp battery which uh, makes this phone probably the phone with the biggest uh, milliamp battery in the cell phone industry right now uh, not removable uh, on the note 5 uh, 3000 milliamp battery not removable uh, both phones support a uh, rapid charging technology. Let me show you guys a uh, quick here the uh, chargers So here are the uh, chargers for each of these phones uh, Right here on the right. We have the uh, turbo power supply And right here we have the uh, adaptive fast charging for Samsung So without further ado, let's go ahead and connect these phones to each of these uh, chargers and start the test and see which one makes it uh, to 100% uh, zero to 100% and in how long. All right, guys, so there you have it. One hour and 58 minutes and 40 seconds it took for the Droid Turbo to get to 100%. Uh, on the uh, Note 5, it took about one hour and 25 minutes. So thank you for watching, guys, and we'll see you later.